Hey, what's up guys? We've got 60 seconds. Let's give you some on-camera flash tips. Hopefully this doesn't take longer than 60 seconds. Well, first tip, don't point your light directly at your subject. Pointing your light directly at the person that you're trying to shoot basically casts some dark shadows. We don't want dark shadows. This is what people call that deer in the headlights kind of look. You don't want that, doesn't look cute. We want to use our light in more effective ways. So the second tip is to soften your flash. If you're using your built-in flash, you're going to have to get a little bit creative here. One way is to take a trash bag and just tie it over the top of there and let that diffuse your light. Another way is to take a piece of paper and just fold it over the top, tape it on there, and that will diffuse your light as well. You can also soften your flash with some Tupperware. Like I said, you gotta get creative. Use whatever you can to soften the light and to make the effect of that light a little bit softer on your subject. So diffusion is basically softening your light. Just using something to soften your light a bit. They have diffusers and domes for speed light. So if you have a speed light, make sure you're using a diffuser or some type of dome to soften up your light. This just makes that light a little bit less harsh. The fourth tip is to balance your flash. You can do this with your built-in camera flash or with the speed light. You want to make sure you're using a larger light source to soften your light. So all we're trying to do is point that light in a direction to the ceiling, to another wall, or something that is large that can make that light seem much bigger than just that little that little flash on the top of the camera. With your built-in camera flash, you can use a piece of paper and just deflect it into a different direction. Deflect it up to the ceiling or deflect it to the, the nearest wall. If you have a speed light of some sort, some of them have swivel heads, so you can actually swivel it directly up or up and over your subject to point at the background, point up to the ceiling, or point over to the nearest wall. Again, all that does is just soften and make that light a lot larger, and it gets rid of those shadows in the background. The last tip I have for you is just to not use your built-in camera flash at all just try to stay away from it it's just not a good option we want to use our light in more effective ways we want to use it so that we get the light and the shadows that we want so the more you shoot you'll see how that light affects and looks on your subject and then you'll eventually move from on camera flash or built-in camera flash or even the speed lights to having that speed light move off of your camera and put it on the light stand somewhere so you get the the cast of light and shadow that you want on your subject's face just try to think of those tips the next time you use your flash and we'll see you guys in the next video just keep filming and peace